guys, welcome back to my Monster Guy collection videos. So last time I did clear, and this time I'm doing my Jackson Jekyll save Frankie Girl. So let's start with the items he comes with. He comes with this bracelet, which actually matches the one on his wrist, a bit blurry. But it has skip detail and the words. He doesn't have the words Monster High on it. Then he's got a brush, which is a skeleton. And then the words well, Monster High going along the handle. I'm so sorry that if you can't read it, it's not a very good colour brush. It's okay when they're like black or something, or blue. It actually shows up quite well. Then he also comes with this um, sort of picture of Frankie in a frame with a little handle. And then if you look at the back, there's a little leaflet about Frankie there with it's not like you've got any writing it's just scribble writing so now let's start on the actual doll so if we start this face he's got the piercing in his eyebrow except this time it's gold exactly all glasses and if you look carefully on his cheek that is a sketch to be like frankie i'm guessing that's like the campaign symbol he's got the yellow streak in his hair, pale lips, so right? quite dark eyes around them. If we look, and I'm actually going to do a quick question. Do you think that Jackson looks better with or without his glasses? I personally think he looks better with his glasses, but I'm open to public suggestions. His top says say Frankie and has lots of symbols that sort of mean stuff about Frankie. Couldn't think of the right word there. Like icons for Frankie. He's also got the yin and yang, which is for him. Classic plaid shorts, which are like Frankie's signature pattern. And similar shoes to Goose Gorgon, except they're blue and yellow without spikes. So if we look carefully at his bracelets, he's got black bracelets and then the one that comes with him. Um, he's quite muscular, which isn't how he's described in the program, but they use the same mould for every girl. He's got moving hands and feet, unlike the girls. Um, of course, no earrings. Um, from the side, he looks the same, except you can see more of the bones there. And back, you get more detail on his hair, because at the front it's a bit boring. So there's full picture, and from the other side, it's basically the same, except you get a better view. If you look carefully, there's lightning bolts on the glasses. So that's about it. Thank you for watching, guys. Next time, I'll be reviewing my Headmistress Blood Good Girl, who's pretty rare. So see you all then. I'm also going to be doing a new thing called Creepy Cribs, which is where I review my bedrooms that I've made for my dolls. See you all soon. Bye!